Hello, Marty Donovan here for another Mastering the Marketplace video. This video provides an overview of the orders dashboard in Commercial Marketplace Analytics and Partner Center. Let's take a look at what we will cover in this module. First, we will provide an overview of the orders dashboard. Next, we will provide an overview of common dashboard elements that are available on the orders dashboard. And finally, I'll provide a brief overview of all widgets in the orders dashboard. Now we start with the orders dashboard. In this section, we'll provide an introduction to the orders dashboard. To leverage commercial marketplace analytics, a publisher needs to be enrolled in the commercial marketplace program, and users need to be assigned the developer or manager role on the publisher account to access commercial marketplace analytics. To access the orders dashboard, you follow the steps listed. You sign into Partner Center, you select the Insights tile, then you select orders. Now we will provide more details on the orders dashboard. The orders dashboard displays the current orders for all your offers with subscription based billing models. You can see things like subscription trends, orders by offers and geography, and a detailed orders table. Next, we cover common dashboard elements. In this section, we will demo the various dashboard elements that are common to all dashboards in Commercial Marketplace Analytics and how to use them. Now to our demo. And these are the common dashboard elements we will cover in this demo. Now we will pull up the orders dashboard inside Partner Center. We do this by selecting Insights, then we select Orders. After doing this, you'll see the orders dashboard. If you notice, that in the dashboard, there's a series of common elements. We will go through those common elements now. If you select download, you have the ability to download your data or download the data as a PDF. If you select share, then it provides you various ways you can share this information. You can share it via an email address and type a message. You can copy a link to the data and share it. You can copy an image of the widgets. You can also share via Teams. Click on Notifications. It'll tell you the latest updates to this service. If you select Data Refresh Details, it gives you the data refresh details for this particular dashboard. If you have feedback, you can select Got Feedback and provide your feedback. If you want to customize the time duration for the dashboard, you can select the time range here. And you can select 6 months, 12 months, or a custom duration of 12 months or less. You also have the ability to filter the dashboard by things like sales channel, offer type, and the other items you see here. You also have the ability to filter the dashboard based on whether an offer is public or private. If I select public offers, it shows the dashboard in terms of public offers. Now we've gone through the common dashboard elements in the orders dashboard, and next, we will actually cover the widgets in the orders dashboard. In this section, we have a demo that walks through all the widgets on the orders dashboard. Now for the demo. We will cover the following widgets in this demo. And now we will go over the, all the widgets in the orders dashboard. First, we will start with the subscriptions trends widget. This section has a subscription chart that shows the trend of your active and canceled subscriptions for the selected month range. The line chart represents the growth trend. There are two subscription counters, active and canceled. Active equals the number of subscriptions that are currently in use by customers for the selected period. Canceled equals the total number of subscriptions that were purchased but got canceled during the selected period. Next, we will cover the Seats, Sites, and Quantity widget. This widget represents the following metrics. The seats for per-user pricing for subscription-based offers, the metrics in trend of sites with flat rate pricing, and the purchase quantity for VM software reservations. Now, we will go to the Billing Term widget. In this widget, you can see orders by billing term. The billing term indicates the contract duration of the offer plan. The bar chart shows the count of active monthly subscriptions for different terms. Next, we go to the billing plan widget. In this widget, you see the orders by billing plan. The billing plan indicates the billing frequency of different plans. The bar chart shows the count of active monthly subscriptions for different plans. 
Now we show the orders by offers widget. The orders by offers widget shows information about offers and plans. This widget shows the measures and trends of all purchased orders. And the orders are categorized under different statuses. The statuses are new, convert, renewed, and cancel. Convert indicates orders for which customers purchased an offer after its trial was over. The widget has three tabs. The orders tab provides information about the count of purchased orders. The quantity tab provides information about the number of seats added or removed by customers for existing active subscriptions. The revenue tab provides information about the billed revenue of orders for the selected period. Now we go to the geographical spread widget. For the selected month range, the table displays the total number of subscriptions and the growth percentage of newly added subscriptions against the geography. And then finally, we have the order details table. This table displays a numbered list of the 500 top orders sorted by date of acquisition. To download the data in CSV format, you can select download, then download data. Now to close this out. After watching this module, a partner should understand the orders dashboard and commercial marketplace analytics in Partner 7. Thank you for joining us for another video from Mastering the Marketplace, the learning library where technologists go to get their offer on the Microsoft Marketplace. For more videos, hands-on labs, and sample code, find us at aka.ms slash mastering the marketplace.